City begin this Titanic month still in the mix for the ultimate treble. A victory today against a side who recently pushed them year on year would be the most significant way to kick off this huge 30 days. Rodri on towards Gundogan, and Gundogan into the gap, and on goes Grealish now. Grealish to the edge of the penalty area, comes in field Grealish, thinks about shooting, plays it to De Bruyne. De Bruyne scoops in across, Van Dijk's in the way, and Liverpool lose it, and De Bruyne then is fouled right on the edge of the D. Free kick to City, brilliant position, and Liverpool with a, well, a mistimed challenge rather than a malicious one. Is it going to be Mares or is it going to be I'm De Bruyne? Boy, it is Mares, and it's beyond the post, beyond the wall, beyond the post, and just wide. Alisson, I think, was confident that it was going beyond his angle. It was close. Pep Guardiola, just for a second, thought it was in. Alisson plays it to Van Dijk. Van Dijk under pressure, back to Alisson. Alisson under pressure, plays it on to Fabinho. They have escaped the press, Liverpool. Alexander-Arnold pops it forward and Schotter's onside here. Schotter down the middle, real chance for Liverpool. He's held up by Akanji and then up comes Salah to pop it into the net. And Liverpool lead. And Mo Salah with this extraordinary scoring record against City has done so once again. Ake's got it about six or seven metres inside the Liverpool half. On it goes to Grealish, Grealish now to De Bruyne. De Bruyne into the gap for Gundogan, Gundogan on towards Alvarez, Mares hits it over the bar. Good chance, it sat up to be volleyed, he connected with it sweetly, but it fizzed over the bar. Yeah, it's probably the, the wrong choice in, in technique, you know, for me, just meet it on the half volley and just pass it into the far corner. So hard to keep that ball down. So City are finding gaps, they are finding chances. Mares on the right-hand side, comes in field, try to play it to Gundogan, it's a corner. City's first of the match, in fact, the match is first. De Bruyne is going to hit an out-swinging ball. It's above Ake, it's headed away well by Schotter. Stones is the furthest back, his head has gone straight to Elliot. Elliot to Salah, Salah now on, on, he's going towards the edge of the City penalty area. Oh, it was poor, you expect better than that from Mo Salah. We've got to give Grealish, oh, we've got to give him credit. Yeah. You know, and, and a turn of pace, because Salah, I thought Salah might go away from him, yeah, but he, he didn't. Couldn't. He made up the yards, um, a tremendous desire in defending. Now, here come the Blues with Mares. he's taking on Van Dijk. He keeps on going, on to Gundogan, into the gap for Grealish. Grealish, Alvarez, 1-1! That is a magnificent goal! That is truly wonderful! A team goal! They rip Liverpool apart! There's gaps to be exploited, and Julian Alvarez makes it 1-1! Maris, who is the danger man, drives inside. This, this, this awareness on Gundogan is different class. What, what, a, what a passage of play, what a move. Fantastic. Absolutely brilliant team goal. I said when these two meet, there's normally a team who goes in front, the other finds an equaliser. Well, they've traded blows again, and it is 1-1 here. And you have to say, it was a superb team goal from City. City, remember, had five clean sheets in a row prior to the international break. Here's Mares, took it down. Now he's at Robertson. Couple of step-overs, keeps on going. Gundogan hits the shot, great block by Fabinho. De Bruyne's offside, but uh, it was a good block by Fabinho, really good from him. Diaz pops a long ball forward, it's headed away by Fabinho. Gundogan gets to the loose one, Ake plays it to Grealish, Grealish in towards Alvarez. Alvarez sweeps it forward down the right-hand side and Mares should get to this, and he will do. And it's into the box and De Bruyne! What a start to City's second half! Mares round the back, De Bruyne on the half volley, and it's City 2, Liverpool 1, and the Blues have turned this match on its head. What a start to the second half didn't even see it coming, it just seemed to develop before us. It didn't seem to be clear and open. It just was so easy. Ball gets inside to Alvarez, Alvarez takes two touches, 
then puts Morris in. De Bruyne is now free and spare. This has to be right. If he gets this right, it's a goal. I mean, wow. Liverpool are still excellent on the counter, but they've lost the ball and Gundogan's onto it. And he's got options left and right. On it goes towards Grealish. Grealish now attacking Alexander-Arnold, pops it in towards Gundogan. Gundogan across the face of the goal, but Alisson is there to gather it. And City is really making lots of gaps, forcing gaps in Liverpool's back line. Stones now, edge of the area, plays it out wide. Mares, Mares on the right hand side, plays it back to De Bruyne. On it goes to Rodri. Rodri into Alvarez. Alvarez to uh, Stones, he's still up there. On it goes now to Mares again. Mares into the penalty area, plays it across. Can't get it to Alvarez. Alvarez, it's blocked. Gundogan, 3 1. City 3, Liverpool 1. Ilkay Gundogan, two goals in nine minutes and Liverpool are being swept away. It was so, so good. They kept the ball, they were patient. And again, that man Maris, when he gets you, he backs you into the box, you're in all sorts of trouble if you are not doubled up. If it's a defender not helping him, he gets in trouble. And once he gets in there, he, the, the right pass to Alvarez, who shows composure onto his left foot, falls to Gundogan and a composed finish. Gakpo on the halfway line, into the gap, there's no offside, Liverpool are racing round the back, real chance for them, Robertson plays it in, it's not great, oh it's been given away by Ake and that's a challenge that looked like it could be a penalty, Gakpo went down, Simon Hooper says no and the play goes on, I'm going to listen out to VAR, see if VAR have a view on it. Ball comes forward, Alvarez is onto it, on the edge of the D, now it's with Grealish, Grealish now in the penalty area, Grealish hits the shot, Alisson makes the save, fascinating action, Gakpo wondered if he'd won a penalty at one end, City then almost score at the other. Great play from Grealish, dropping inside, you know we're going to start seeing these eventually, they're going to find that far corner, great save from Alisson, I'm not sure what happened at the other end, it's a great bit of play from, from, from Liverpool but Oh no, that's a yellow oh, card. The yellow card, he's put yeah. you back in there. Yeah, referee Simon Hooper got it absolutely right. Stones, always available, always in a pocket of space, in between the lines. Yeah, it's just a, he just offers a pivot, doesn't he? He doesn't play too many forward passes, or you know, there's no assists there, or or breathtaking diagonals. He just keeps rotating the ball, and it's uh, so important to what Pep does. He needs that second. The double pivot in there all the time, and he does it fantastically well. Absolutely. Now Gundogan, beautiful ball, changes the angle, on it goes, De Bruyne's in the area, looking up for the right pass, Grealish, magnificent! You'll not see a better team goal than that. I'm afraid I didn't count the passes, but one thing I can count is the number of goals, and City lead. Four goals to one, and Erling Haaland's on a watching brief today, but he's one of the first to his feet to applaud. Delighted for Grealish for the way he's played today, and then Liverpool have just got torn to shreds. What they're doing is they go left to right, right to left. If they then compact the middle, the big diagonal switch comes in. Kevin De Bruyne is not picked up, he runs in behind, the timing of the pass is brilliant. Alexander switches off, doesn't track Jack. Goal, brilliant, absolutely fantastic football for Manchester City look at the smile on his face so so pleased um, for that young man for all he does and uh, the City fans are absolutely loving this they lead Liverpool by four goals to one and when you looked at City's running if we can call it that this far out you looked at the awkward fixtures that they had to overcome this was one of them Andy but uh, yes yeah hasn't proven to be Here's De Bruyne on the edge of the area, he pops it in, Grealish on the volley, blocked by Alisson, good save, he was in the right position. And that concludes the most wonderful start to April. It is a huge month for the Blues, they face all sorts of challenges in three different competitions and Liverpool kicked it all off today. City 4. Liverpool 1.